Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. An East Kentucky network company. Data speeds slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for motors. See store for more details. Word of a fight between high school students isn't something that generally draws a lot of attention. However, a video that was posted to social media Wednesday evening that appears to show one Prestonsburg high school student brutally assaulting another has captured the attention of the entire region. Interim Floyd County School Superintendent Steve Trimble says it happened around 2 p.m. Wednesday. The school administration here at Prestonburg High School dealt with the situation immediately as soon as they found out about it and uh, and uh, took action, called the city police, and they came, and they came promptly. We appreciate their help, and, uh, and we dealt with it at that time. And because of the severity of the situation, the decision was made to notify the Floyd County Attorney's Office, who is now prosecuting the case. Everyone was working together by the end of the school to handle everything and get it under control and take proper uh, measures that needed to be taken with this. Superintendent Trimble told EKB News the victim was taken for a medical evaluation. The mother took him directly to the emergency room and uh, where they checked him out thoroughly. And uh, uh, again, when he left here, he was okay, and, but they wanted to make sure that he was okay. So uh, that was suggested to the mom and she was willing to do that. The video of the assault was seen by thousands of people, including the students who attend Prestonsburg High School. And because of the severity of the assault, Principal Lori Bricken made sure that counselors were available to students on Thursday at the school. And our counselors are here to talk to those students and to listen to them. Um, and then we will also be meeting with um, each grade level today. Um, again, this kind of behavior is completely unacceptable. Thankfully, the victim was treated and released from a local hospital and received no significant injuries. The student that that happened to yesterday is uh, okay. Talked to the mother this morning. He's doing fine and he's also in class today. The investigation into the assault is being conducted by the Prestonsburg Police Department and in addition to any charges that may be pending against the student responsible for the assault, the assistant county attorney says additional students could be facing charges. We are looking into other things that may potentially have happened yesterday. Um, there's an investigation still going on of, um, you know, people recording it, people who may have potentially set this up. EKB News will continue to follow this developing story and will bring you any additional information as it becomes available. In Prestonsburg, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.